idea of narrative and whose perspective um, is heard. And so the text that we're using, the um, freedom and the autonomy that we as teachers have to, to make lessons relevant, they can see themselves in the story more broadly and there's more touch points for them. And that I think makes everything they're experiencing right now more real. It's so inspiring as they, they know they can do better. They know that we can be better as a community and as a society. And so I see them kind of drawing strength from the lessons of the past and the experiences of the present to really point them towards a more hopeful future. What helps me speak up against hate is generally knowing that people in the past that I admire and look up to stood up against their hate. Even if they weren't known for standing up for it, they still did and everyone that I admire, you know, did that and I want to do that too. American Studies really lets you be you and that's why I enjoy going to her classroom. If I could, I would go every day so I, I like when I get my voice heard like speaking up for my black communities and every day I learn something new. And so if we can be able to speak up for everybody, then the world can change. The more you fight hate, the more that it uh, disappears. And if you fight hate, then it'll create a better place for everybody. And that's good. We want people to feel included. We were following the Chauvin trial and other instances of racial news. The instances of Asian hate became really prominent in the news. We, we had a session outside of school hours for students who were interested in fighting back against uh, Asian racism. And so many students showed up for that and they were so passionate about doing something there. I thought we could do some kind of initiative together where students get to decide how they want to keep fighting racism, how they want to support the community, and how, how they can work together to accomplish those goals. The class as a group and other classes, we're going to decide if we're going to uh, give food to the homeless or like do um, shirts, shoes, and like a whole outfit uh, that's going to be saying Black Lives Matter. We've uh, done a protest. We've walked out of school like, like tw 20 minutes before the bell and we were chanting Black Lives Matter. I want to stand up for our Asian community and uh, the black community too uh, because the, their lives matter as much as everybody's lives matter. I, I'm just really, they're phenomenal students. So there's, there's hope for the future. If anybody is wondering, <laughs> uh, there's a lot of hope for the future.